But nothing you said was valid. None of it backs it up. Is the Constitution a book? I'm just, I'm curious, asking for a friend. Is it a book? Last I checked, it was not. We got to go into our last story. You know, time's, time is starting to wrap up or time's starting to run out. Um, now, uh, okay. All right. I've been waiting for this one. I've been waiting for this one. This one's special, y'all. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, apparently, uh, a good luck Charlie actress was at a uh, was at a Williamson County School Board talking about her particular views on the mandate for her son in this school. The video was crap. All right. But just listen to what she's saying. Oh, and by the way, she was in a hit Disney show called Good Luck Charlie, just in case you don't can't read what was saying up above. Yeah, she was entertaining our, our little children. Let's 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 listen. My name's Lee Allen Baker, and I'm a California refugee. <laughs> I gave up everything there, a really successful Hollywood career, television shows, gave it all up for freedom and to come to this friendly place in Tennessee and be greeted with open arms, and I love it here. Um, I wanted to tell you that I have two vaccine-injured children, and they have medical exemptions because after the seizures and the hospitalizations, after all of their immunizations, I was granted, obviously, a medical so my children are those rare children that will just not be able to get them. And still, I would never put them in a mask because their brain needs oxygen to grow. Which the I'm, I'm sorry. What? Let me roll that back one more time. Because she said her, they're, they're not going to be wearing masks because her children need oxygen for their brain. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. I'm, I'm going to roll it. I'm just I'm just trying to make this make sense. Make this make sense. Por favor. OK. Oxygen to grow, which the neurologist can confirm. Uh, anyway, the real part of the clown show is that you all think that you actually have the authority to mandate this <laughs> because um, there are these books that I have and I have them as a gift for you. The Constitution and the Declaration of Independence. OK, I'm sorry. Is the co the Constitution is a book? Is the Constitution a book? Is the Constitution a book? I'm just wa I'm waiting. Huh? Scroll, it's not a book. It's a scroll, not a book. Yes. I'm sorry. I go I got to roll that back. She said clown show too, by the way. This is a clown show. Let's let, let I'm just going to roll it back cuz for all y'all in the nosebleed seats that can't hear this, let me just play one more time because this is some this is some bull ish. Let's go. Can confirm. Uh, anyway, the real part of the clown show is that you all think that you actually have the authority to mandate this because um, there are these books that I have, and I have them as a gift for you, the Constitution and the Declaration of Independence, the Bill of Rights, and the Federalist Papers, and also the Bible, and these guarantee my freedom and yours and our children's to breathe oxygen. Okay. 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 Uh okay. Let, let's let's let let me just let me let me can't how how is this okay so let me let me break something down for you. Let me let me break something down for this 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 lady here. Um, let let me just let me just say this. Uh, when it comes to this situation, we are doing whatever we can so we can dodge this ish, like it's dodgeball, okay? Because it's coming at us in every single angle we can even think of, okay? Now, when it comes to this situation, like you got good luck, Charlie, the actress from Good Luck Charlie. Trying to come in and 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 tr and trying to come in in an intelligent angle, yet none of what she's saying is intellectual at all. She is basically sounding like every other woman, or uh, sorry, not woman, but person out here that is spouting out the same crap that they see on their 
platforms that they read every single day. You got a doctor, okay, that can come up and say what they need to say. You, you're saying that you have doctors to confirm that these are stifling your children from breathing in the earth. What is this? Are you sure about that? Because I wear them all the time. I wear them if I'm going to the gym. I wear them to go to the grocery store. I'm seeing plenty of kids wearing these things, and they still acting exactly how they, they act. Motor skills are still the same. They're still able to play video games and read a book and write papers and know how to, you, you know, move their mouth and, and eat and take a poop. So I don't understand how that suddenly stifles a child's d brain development. How does that wearing a mess that up? Now, now I, I get it that you had your moment in time. Right. I get it that you had the you know, you were acting a fool and having a great time and being an actress on a on a on a TV show that was a popular TV show back in the day. I don't know if it's still on anymore. Obviously, it's not you in Tennessee, but that's another conversation in itself. So you go up and you say that first just to say, yes, I'm a celebrity, just so you know. <laughs> but I have to say this about the masks. OK, but nothing you said was valid. None of it backs it up. Is the Constitution a book? I'm just, I'm curious, asking for a friend. Is it a book? Last I checked, it was not. David said, it's a scroll. It is. So why would you say any of that? Clearly, if you start off with that, you ended bad. You crashing and burning, baby. I'm sorry. Instantly, you say, oh, because, you know, because of this clown show? Are you the clown show with nothing to back it up? Hmm. Huh. Okay. But you think that because you were on a show called Good Luck Chuck, sorry, Good Luck Charlie, that you can just go on this mic and, and think you're rocking the mic. And what's funny is some of the reactions in the background, they're all like, oh my God. A celebrity is finally backing us up. No, you, that celebrity is sounding like an ass. She sounds everything she's co is coming out of her mouth is just hot er, hot er. Probably spreading all kinds of <clears throat> rona all up in that place because you clearly are not practicing the things that need to be done so that we can stay safe out here. And then now what's sad is that you're also planting those seeds into your children's heads. So all that ignorance. Yes, I said ignorance, not ignorance. Ignorance is going into your child, into your children. And then you're going to spread that ish like a to everybody else. That entire room was infected by your stupidity. Yes, I said it. Bro, I'm, I'm going on Stairmasters, all right, with a mask on. Yeah, it's not the easiest thing to do, but I'm still breathing. Shoot, I'm still here. I almost cursed. Shit, yeah. I'm still here. Look, I'm still here. This is it's solid cat. body. This is not a spirit. I'm not a ghost, you know, floating around. I am real. And I'm using that stuff going to the gym. You're telling me kids can't put... David, go ahead, man. I'm, I'm Somebody talk to me, man. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> I was going to... If you want me to, I can link to the Twitch video we did. Uh, yes, please, please send that link. All right. So near the end of that one, I go into detail. Uh, we're, we can't really talk about it on YouTube f without getting banned. Right. But I go into detail on the best way to use masks and how effective they can be. Um, uh, which, which uh, even if you are wearing them, you need to do the other stuff by itself. It's not enough. You know, if they were telling us, they would not tell us to put these things on our faces if it was going to have a negative effect like death okay muerte it, they would literally say hey don't you know what i'm saying don't wear these we got to figure something else out we'll figure it out and we'll have something for you guys you see what i'm saying like i i just don't understand the 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 the, the anger and frustration that is going around in this country right now over 
over keeping people safe. I don't fully understand it, y'all. It is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Stupid. You got people who are, there's viral videos that are going on all over the place. Maybe I'll do it as a pop-up video later on today. But there are literally videos of parents. These are grown-ass people acting like children. Acting like ignorant-ass children. I said it. They're pointing at people that are doctors or surgeons that are sitting there going, yes, I don't think it's a good idea for the kids to be going around not wearing masks right now. You know, numbers are high, so on and so forth. We can't say a whole lot because, you know what I'm saying, bots. But at the same time, you're running over. They're running over to that guy's car. Parents, these are parents, y'all, pointing at these these kids, these guys, these doctors that, is, that are naysayers going against the anti right? And they're going, we know who you are. We know where you live over a mask. For real, though? So much that the Williamson County school meeting, they had to bring in the actress just to so, say, oh, yes, I was in a show. And put in her p- opinion. What? It's just, <laughs> these are parental units, y'all. Parental units. And they're acting, they're acting less mature than the, it's un, It's unbelievable to me. You know what I'm saying? T, what are your thoughts? Well, I mean, working in a school with kids and having a mandate this past year, it's just part of the norm. My own five-year-old, she wears a mask every day at preschool and she's been fine. Um, and, and I guess you can say like, in terms of like the normal school flus and school bugs it was like almost, you know, it didn't happen at all. Kids weren't sick at all due to like the, 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 the flu or any kind of, you know, um, usual bacterial bug. Um, cause they had masks on and kids were not sneezing on each other and touching things. So if anything, it did help decrease any kind of school wide illness which usually plagues schools throughout the year. Um, so I'm not against masks at all. I think they're, they, they, they serve a purpose. Are they, are they 100% um, protective from COVID? I don't think they are, but I'd rather have a mask on than not in terms of somebody sneezing or coughing or spitting or any kind of bodily fluid. I'd rather have some kind of protection from. So just off of the general... Um, Safety guidelines. Um, I, 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 you know, I would have a mask. I would have, I would have a mask on. I'll say that. Um, it seems like this whole mask thing has been politicized, and, um, and we've all seen this since the former president was putting it out there all the time. You know, people who follow, you know, his gospel have politicized wearing as being um, infringement upon their freedoms. And it's it's really to me hypocritical because historically, you know, in this country, there's always been groups of people who had real infringements upon their freedoms. But when they would talk up about those infringements, you would tell them to get over it. Okay, you you would you would tell them to just comply, right? Uh-huh. So so in this case, it's different. So I'm I'm confused by the hypocrisy with that. It's just. Throw it on your face, yeah. protect yourself and your family, stop being a selfish fool, whatever. Stop, stop being an ignorant ass. Yeah. Basically. And there it is, y'all. I mean, you know, at, at the end of the day, stop being an ignorant ass. That's it. Just stop being an ignorant ass. And it doesn't matter. I don't care. You, you know, th- this, this, this d- disease that's floating around, this thing that we're, we're battling every single day, I mean, real talk doesn't care who you are. It gives zero dams on who you are and what you represent. Doesn't matter if you're on a show like Good Luck Charlie. It doesn't freaking matter. There's no privilege with this particular. This, this. We have to be safe out here. And we should not be listening to people who just, you know, 
are actors or used to be actors. We should be listening to the people, to the, the, the experts and the scientists and the doctors that are out here that know more about this than us. Stop acting like children and start figuring out what is needed to be done so that you can stay on this planet just a little bit longer. And that's it. That's all I want for my people. All right. For all y'all, be safe out here, guys. P-A-S-C-A-L. You are now rocking with that dude, Pascal. We be going wild.